It's an absolutely beautiful day in Bromley today as the boys take on Maidenhead in the National League on TNT Sports. Hopefully we can get the win today and make ourselves six games unbeaten and continue to fly up the National League table. Join me on my route to the game. Hoping to get to the ground a little bit early today before kickoff to check out some of the great community activities going on at the club. I'd like to say 3 0 Bromley, be a close match, but see what happens. 3 uh, 2 to Bromley. 3 1 to Bromley. Alright, lads, what's your score prediction for today? 3 0. 3 0. Going for 2 0. Right, now I'm just going to nip over to the exec club and see what's going on inside. How are you guys finding the match day hospitality? First class. It's uh, something we've always said we'd come along to and um, really enjoy it. The food's terrific, the hospitality's great. We're going to win today as well. It's been a really fantastic day. So friendly, as you said, lovely food. Can't wish for more, and I can't wait for them to win. No, it's, it's a great experience down at Bromley now. The hospitality is fantastic. The service they provide is unreal. I would recommend it to anybody who wants to come down here to have a great day. We became Young Player of the Year for our own football club, but also Young Player of the Year for the league, the National League. He won that accolade as well. So well done, Kevin. Are you excited to work on today's game? Uh, really excited. Always love coming to Bromley because they've got the best and most um, accommodating people around the club. The infrastructure is obviously incredible, the work that's been done around here, and we always get a good game of football as well. Can I get your score prediction for today's game? Uh, well, look, everything really points towards a nil-nil, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, the way that Maidenhead are playing, their last three games have been a nil-nil. They don't let many goals in, and, and also you know, Bromley haven't necessarily been scoring loads. But that said, I think, look, it's an individual game of football and anything can happen. So hopefully we're going to have a 4-3 win for either side, impartial, of course. Lineups are out now. It's the same lineup that beat Ultram 2-1 last weekend. So hopefully the boys can get another positive result and win the game. Come on, the Bromley. Right, off the pitch now, and into the stands. Kick off in about two minutes. Teams lining up. Come on, the Bromley. Let's get this win. Right, it's half time. 3 0 to the Bromley. Fantastic atmosphere, fantastic goals, a Michael Cheek brace, and a goal from Sam Woods. Absolutely fantastic scenes. Hopefully, we can continue that into the second half. Seal this game with a win and a few more goals in the second half. That is full time, probably four, 
Maiden had won. Great result. Fantastic win. On to next week. Big thank you to the fans today. Great support, especially on international weekends. Big three points. We go again. Given him one round of applause, but he scored twice, so let's give him another one. Ladies and gents, Michael G! How have you played, or was it over 100 minutes in that weather? Towards the end, you can see like the game died quite a bit, but um, yeah, the lads get through it, and I think we're really going through it as well, so yeah, I'm to hold him.